So I reads the title, and it says something about uh, digging out a boat dock or whatever. And the fucking clown is standing there with a shovel in his hand. So, of course, curiosity got the better of me. And I clicked on the motherfucker. And it's it's just as I suspected. <laughs> fucking SWV. Good fucking God. <laughs> Dude handles a shovel like a fucking... Uh, I don't know, a, a fucking princess. <laughs> you can tell that that fucking faggot has never done a day's worth of manual labor in his entire fucking life. Fucking soft. Soft with a T. Soft with a capital T on the end. Soft. -t. <sighs> I mean, the guy uses a fishing glove. <laughs> Used to be. <laughs> it's a song which also from the last album. It tells the story of how we recorded it and what went wrong when we did it. Switzerland, the song is thing called Smoke on the Water. Damp Wolf, I'm keeping an eye out for those, uh, those, those Modellos. I can only get the regular Chiladas around here, and I think they're fucking delicious. But the black one, I'm, I, I'm stoked to try that. Yep. Yeah. Uh, low-key Chilada fan. Used to be. Yeah, I'm going to bring the clown up again. SWV, I got a question for you. Why the fuck did you allow Reet Gieb to get away with that? No, I don't mean fucking pissing himself and pissing all over the, the fucking passenger seat in the gay marrow. That's not what I'm talking about. All the fucking horrible fucking footage that you guys uploaded... From that terrible fucking meetup in that shithole fucking state of Indiana. 
It was every other fucking word out of Reek Gibbs' mouth. Shout out to Earl Portland. Shout out to Earl Portland. N-word, you fucking hate Earl Portland. You can't stand Earl Portland. But no, you, you didn't say a fucking word. You just like, yep, yep. Good fucking God. Now, if that would have been, you know, a call in on the burner phone on the podcast, you would have you would have had some shit to say. I'm sure of it. But since you were standing right next to the guy, you didn't have shit to say. Just like, you know. Well, you had some shit to say when Big Foam got attacked. You you had some shit to say, like, that's a joke. That's a joke. But you sure didn't do shit about it. Like I said, soft. You know, we're approaching the, the fucking most wonderful time of the year. My favorite time of the year. The time when the autumn leaves fall. When the fucking stifling temperature starts to cool down. You know, the veil gets thinner. Yeah. Yep. Approaching the Halloween season, folks. I'm just sitting here thinking, you know, who's... Who's all dead? And I don't mean like, you know, uh, uh, stay dead Jack or stay dead Machete. Uh, no, I mean really uh, 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 tag on the fucking toe dead. You know, like uh, Tiny Tim Rauschader. Rest in peace. Uh, Mr. Raj, rest in peace. BM Upper, blah, blah, BM Upper One. Uh, I don't know about Rest in Peace for you, guy. I, I don't know. I have to think about that one. Uh, HPD 77. Definitely no Rest in Peace for you. No. <laughs> no, you don't get no Rest in Peace at all. Uh, who else? Oh, and of course, Todd Minus. Absolutely fucking Rest in Peace to Todd Minus. Todd Minus was a fucking good and decent guy. You know, quick story about Todd Minus. Todd Minus almost got me into a world of shit one time. It wasn't even his fault. But it was back in the Uvu days. We're on fucking Uvu. And, uh... He's just sitting there in his apartment. And there's some random broad walking around behind him. And, uh, you know, we're just sitting, I forget, I, I can't even remember who else was on the fucking thing. It was me and Todd Minus, and there was some other people, and the other people I can't fucking remember. But anyway, we're sitting there, and this random broad's walking around in the room behind, behind Todd Minus. And then just, all of a sudden, with no prompting, just out of fucking nowhere, the bitch fucking strips. Butt booty fucking naked. And the first thing I do is snap my fucking head around to make sure Mrs. Vega ain't in the fucking room. <laughs> and then I'm just sitting there like, I mean, I'm in stunned fucking silence. Like, 
did this bitch just do what I think this bitch just did? And yeah, th what made it even more surreal is I think Todd Minus was sitting there eating powdered donuts. And he didn't bat an eye at it. It was very fucking strange. Weird even. But but in a good way. R.I.P. Todd Minus. Used to be. Motherfucker, you ever hold the 40 with the same grip for too long and your fucking fingers cramp up? Uh, old folks doing stuff. Used to be. We're at the Junior Mart, and I'm going to dedicate this Junior Mart to Deep Purple, simply because if you happen to own, I'm going to be generous, if you happen to own a six-stringed instrument, a, a guitar of any kind, if you will, no matter if you're an enthusiast or it's just a wall decoration or, you know, it's, it's fucking, I don't know, a hand-me-down that's been stuffed under your bed for years or whatever. Doesn't matter. If there is a guitar in your possession and, and you cannot at the very least... Play the riff to smoke on the water. Just end it. Just fucking end it. Swole. 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 And Richie Blackmore will, will hate you for playing it. Which is all the more reason to learn it. It takes two seconds, even if you've never picked up a guitar before. Used to be. Go fuck yourselves.